What is up, internet? It's your boy, Monk's Blood. We're here to show you a couple quick little tips to help you get going with some Grand Theft Auto roleplay. You get into the Royale server, if you're a member, you gotta get in here. Got to get in here. This is the screen when you join the server. Click here, create character. You gotta think about who do I want to portray? What type of character am I? So right now, just for this, we'll do a little John Doe. Birthday. I don't know. Don't put your regular birthday. Or do put your regular birthday so it's easy to remember if police are trying to ask for your date of birth. For this, let's just do uh, 1997. Uh, height in centimeters. Quick little reference. 182 centimeters is about 6 feet. So that's what I like to do. Boom. Super easy. Create your character. Oh, look at that. Spaces. Joe Doe. The first thing you want to do when you get out of the subway, you hit the streets. You know, maybe you want to get a car. And uh, check some things. You know, figure some stuff out. Looks like we got a lot of gunmen here. But before all that, let's check your settings. Step one, get into your settings, check your voice chat, make sure your voice chat is enabled and your talking is enabled, make sure it's your regular microphone that you use. Some people go to, um, you can also go, can to, also voice go to voice activity, and I prefer push to talk, but make sure these numbers are up, because defaults don't have this on. So this is huge. Alright. That's another quick little tip. Um, for you guys. And check your key bindings. Just normal stuff when you get into a game. You should be doing this anyway. But if not. You know. Added, added little feature right there. Make sure you check your key bindings. Uh, default is N. For push to talk. That is default. So get out of here. Quick little tap. In this server. F1 on your keyboard brings up your phone and everything phone inventory vehicles money bring up your phone telephone boom right there police something happened you gotta report something police ambulance taxi call a taxi it'll give you a ride a lot of these taxi people are helpful they want to help you they want you to have a good time so any one of these will help you out in this server. Um, okay, we're back. Life Invader. This right here is where you find your information right here, Job Center. Job Center, there's multiple uh, icons also on the map. Um, the houses right now, you can go into and rob um, if there's two cops on. If there's four, you can do a bank heist. Uh, also, the money signs are where you access your banks. So places you need to know, uh, right off the bat, is this location. Clothes, if you want to change your clothes. It's a t-shirt uh, icon, super simple. Also, car dealer. Car dealer, which we will get into in a little bit later of this video. Right, gone. Vehicle shop green car and all these icons are in here this is normal if you play grand theft auto you know you know how to go scroll through these and uh, figure all that stuff out but let's go check into the information desk here life invader if you played the campaign of grand theft auto you, you've been in this building before pretty sweet multiple jobs throughout the area and you got to figure out you know what is my character what do they want to do Take a look. So you have a farmer. Are you a farmer? Are you a lumberjack? Are you a miner? Maybe you're a fisherman. Brewer. Don't know what this word is. Courier. Garbage collector or taxi person. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what that is. But that's pretty much jobs in a nutshell. Uh, once you access this, uh, it'll bring up other things on your map. Um... It'll bring up other icons and unlock things 
uh, that are job oriented. They only your job will have these tasks and these icons, which is very cool. Um, like right here is uh, garbage. I'm sure you have to go there once you're a garbage collector. Taxi Depot right up here. Um, and you'll be able to clock in to these jobs and you get a daily wage. You get a daily wage and you also get bonuses for completing tasks. Um, obviously, if you're a lumberjack, you know, chopping down trees and delivering products in certain areas, you'll get more money. Same thing with all these jobs. Um, and that's pretty much jobs. If you want to switch jobs, you have to come back here, um, resign, and then you have to um, pick a new job. If you want to change jobs, you know, put your two weeks notice in. All right, banking. You got some money? Figure out, okay, what can I do with this money? Banking. Deposit. So various items, like when you're buying a car, your bank, you need to be, have your money deposited. If you're buying stuff at the store, you need to have it on hand. If you're giving money, let's say, to a taxi driver for driving you around, that needs to be cash on hand. Also, need to mention these bars down here. This is your food, this is your drink. You do need to drink and eat items. You need to consume items. So that's another thing you will need cash for. Items are cheap. Just go to uh, that here real quick. Any store, uh, item store right here, will have various items. Tacos, chips, water, whatever you want. Um, I suggest you get a hit there after you purchase your first vehicle. Uh, get, get some supplies on hand. You never know what you're going to run into out here in the city. Okay, we're here at the uh, car shop. You can go ahead and purchase your vehicle. No problem. Think, oh, what kind of vehicle would Joe Doe drive? Uh, I only have 8,000 in the bank, so I can't really get too crazy. No, not, not gonna happen. See what kind of sedans. That looks perfect. That's my whip. Enter. Again, use your arrow keys. Bam. Beautiful. Bank balance updated. Engine on. Hit your seatbelt. Also, very important, you will fly outside of the car. Yeah, yeah. Clothing. Very important. You need to fit the part. So you get into your clothing. You know, bring up a menu like this. Use your arrow keys. Bam. Change your head. Now what, what, what is that gonna look like? And you just scroll over through the components. Texture doesn't look like there's any option, but color. Okay, mask, hair. Okay. You know, you just scroll through here, kind of figure out what you want. Um, also, sometimes there'll be some glitches right here. See the arms, skin. Go over. That'll fix your, uh, like we need an undershirt. That'll fix the, that look there. Oh, yeah, look at that. Look at that hitter. I mean, that it's simple. Once you figure it out, use your arrow keys. You know, there's so many options, a lot of variations. You can make your character as good or bad. Womp. Also... Looks like you guys are about ready to get started. Got your job, got your clothes, got your car, got the bank. Next step, in game. T. Flash. Wheat. Be in character. Okay, if you just go in here, it's OOC. That stands for outer character. Try to keep that chat free of various items don't just be in here spamming a bunch of things say you're at a job you're tweeting say hey i'm on the clock ems is live that's fine try to keep it necessary you know don't just be spamming tweets 
Okay. I think you guys are ready. Let me know if I missed anything, need to add anything. Oh, we're gonna try to get this up as soon as possible. This whole way to be able to answer some of you guys' questions. All right. I'm Monk's Blood. We'll see you out there. Later.